In this video we're going to learn how to screencast from your Nextworld virtual reality training headset. So once you've turned the headset on and you've set your player boundary, all you need to do is hit the Pico button on your hand controller and that will bring you to this Pico menu and then you simply select the screencasting icon there. This will bring up a bunch of different options that you can use depending on whether you have internet or don't uh, and I'm going to walk you through what each of these options are. The first option we have is called Cast to TV, but this will work for any device that has access to the Android Play Store, as the only thing involved is downloading an app. Uh, in this example, I'll be using a Samsung tablet, so if you swap over to that device and go to the Play Store, you can download the app Cast for Pico, um, and this will work again on any phone, tablet, or TV that has access to a Play Store. Uh, once you've downloaded that, open it up on your app, and then once you switch back to your headset, you can see that the device is listed there. And then all you have to do is uh, select connect. And then as you can see, it is transferred over to the tablet. This is one of the internet casting options. So for this to work, you will need the headset and your device that you're casting to to be connected to the same internet network. The next option we're gonna look at is cast a browser. So this will allow you to cast to your computer or any device that can open a Chromium based browser such as Chrome, Edge, Brave. Uh, it just won't work for Safari or Firefox. Uh, so what you're going to do once you've selected that option is copy the IP address that you can see there into your internet browser as I'm doing. Uh, so once again you will need your headset and the device you're casting to to be connected to the same internet network. Once you press enter, it'll take you to this page and simply select start stream recording. It'll ask you to confirm on your headset and once you've done that can see that that is casting nicely. The final option we're going to look at today is called mirror casting. So this is your wireless option. Uh, select the little icon at the top right of the screen there and it will list all of the available devices to cast to. So this will be any smart TV with mirror casting functionality or any Windows PC or laptop with the Connect app installed. So if I bring up that Connect app on my computer, all you do is select the device off the screen on your headset and it will begin casting as such. If you're trying to mirror cast to a Windows PC or laptop, you will first need to install the Connect app following the instructions on screen. If you're trying to mirror cast after updating from an old software version, you may encounter this dialog box. To enable mirror casting again, simply go to industry settings, then scroll all the way to the bottom and turn off global anti-dispersion. You will be prompted to restart your headset and then after doing so, you'll be able to access mirror cast. If you have any more questions or trouble getting started, you can go to our support article on our website under Getting Started and that will list all of the information we've gone over today. Otherwise, get in touch with us at support at nextworldxr.com.